Hi everyone, I'm Ivan from WebWash and today we'll look at the bundle copy module. Also, don't forget you can learn more about Drupal by going to our website at webwash.net where we post videos and tutorials. And if you like, join our newsletter or follow us on Twitter at webwashnet. A bundle copy is the Drupal 7 version of the content copy module, which shipped with CCK in Drupal 6. In Drupal 7, nearly all of CCK's functionality was moved into core. However, content copy didn't make it into Drupal 7. It exists as its own contributor module as bundle copy. So what is bundle copy? The module allows you to import and export entity bundles. Out of the box, the module supports nodes, taxonomy, and user. For example, if you created a content type called blog, using bundle copy, you can export the content type and fields, and then import the content type into another site. This module will save you time if you simply want to replicate the same content type or vocabulary. Let's now test out the module. So here, I've got two websites. Website one, and this one's website two, okay? So the first thing we'll do is go and enable the module. Make sure you have C tools installed. The module has a dependency on C tools. So I'll just find bundle, and here I've got C tools installed, and I'll enable the module. Once the module's enabled, just go to uh, content types, and then you will see an export tab and a import tab. And this is and and this is the same for taxonomy, export and import. So what I've done here is I've created a blog content type called blog, and I've added a field called teaser image. So what I'll demonstrate. What I'll demonstrate is I will export, uh, sorry, I will export the, the blog content type, select which fields I want to export. For, the, for this example, I will export both of them out. And now bundle copy simply export, um, generates an array, which you simply then import into the second site. So what I'll do is I will copy this big, big array, go to our second site, and I have already installed the module. So we'll just go to import, copy it into here and hit import. And there you go. Everything's been imported in. If we go to content types, we have blog with our teaser image field. Let's now do the same for taxonomy. So we'll go to structure and click on taxonomy. Here I've created a, a taxonomy vocabulary called category. And I'll just go to export. Again, the same thing, select category. There are no custom fields on this category. And I'll just copy that and then go to taxonomy, import, and paste that and hit import. And if we go back to taxonomy, you can see category has been imported in. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment.